Sayulita is a lovely little beach town on the west coast of Mexico. If you're not swimming, surfing, relaxing, or eating delicious food, there are some wonderful stores in town to get busy shopping. In this video, I'm going to show you some of my favorite stores in Sayulita, from budget-friendly keepsakes to higher-end designs. This is part of our Sayulita series, so if you'd like to see more videos about what to do, where to eat, and where to stay, I'll link them in the description box. First up for shopping is Revolución del Sueño, and to me, this is basically Sayulita in the form of a shop. It's light and bright and colorful, and stepping inside just instantly lifts your mood. This is one of my favorite stores in Sayulita. As soon as you walk in, you just feel happier because there's so many bright colors and textiles and soft plushy things to touch. And pretty little bags like this. Mas amor, por favor. More love, please. Something we can all get behind. And I want to buy it all, not gonna lie. <laughs> there are a lot of different kinds of products from bags to blankets to pillows and Sayulita's signature pom-poms. You can also find this cultural symbol called the Eye of God, which is used by the local Wichol indigenous group as a form of protection. There are different sizes and it even comes as keychains. I loved both these beach bags with the happy hearts. Which would you pick, the red or the pink? You know I love Frida Kahlo and I've made videos about her, so I was instantly attracted to this poster. They also had Frida as a skater, which Mark loved too. I don't know, do you guys like Frida the surfer or Frida the skater better? There are a lot of things I want to buy in the store, but this, Frida as a surfer, that's coming home with me. Everything at Revolución del Sueño is made in small workshops in small quantities so that they can keep bringing out new designs all the time. There's also an online shop, which I'll link in the description box if you want to take a look. I'm so happy right now. I got a beach blanket and my Frida surf poster. <laughs> Next up is a store called Evoke the Spirit, where the color palette is more neutral and the store feels calm and curated. Everything in this store feels really cohesive and it's because it's all designed by one woman, the owner, whose name is Brittany, and she works with a whole bunch of local artists, indigenous artists, to create everything that you see in the store. So there's beautiful jewelry and rugs, different textiles, art for the walls, and then ceramics, which I always love have my eye on, on this guy. <laughs> that little ceramic pot did go home with me, by the way. <laughs> this piece of art made with dyed thread was something I still wish were mine, since it was totally love at first sight and I haven't stopped thinking about this since I saw it. From the jewelry to the textiles and ceramics and the art, everything at Evoke the Spirit just has a very handmade and special feel about it. Another shop selling beautifully locally made products is called Artifacto. This place is teeny tiny, but they've packed in a lot of little treasures. And the main thing I love here are the different textiles, specifically the Otomi designs. Traditional Otomi patterns, which are named for the Otomi indigenous group that created them, are some of my favorites in the entire world. They're usually full of color and depict flowers and birds and animals. And Artifacto sells high quality Otomi textiles in the form of pillowcases and bed covers, wall hangings, as well as fabric that you can just use however you want to. The next store you should follow your heart to is Corazon Dafa, which means Heart of Hafa. This store is part of a boutique hotel in Sayulita called Petit Hotel Hafa, and they only have eight rooms, so if you're not lucky enough to be staying in one of those rooms, you can still come to the store here and look around. The hotel itself is lovely, and it's featured in another of my videos about where to stay in Sayulita, so I'll link that. And some of what you can buy in the shop features parts of the hotel's design, like this little walkway painted with hearts. Of course, the name of the store is Heart of Hafa, so hearts figure into a lot of their products, including this beautiful dream catcher. You'll also find jewelry here, including a lot made with pearls. The next store isn't located inside a hotel, but it's actually an open air stand right at the entrance to one. Right next to the steps of Sayulita Central is Nakawe. What really stands out to me here are the hand embroidered things, like letters, pom-poms, other kinds of hanging decor, and little keepsakes like these Frida dolls. The colors used here are a bit different and more unique than I saw elsewhere, and it looks like extra time and care has gone into making them. Just down the street from Nakawe, a little closer to the beach, is Pachamama. Unfortunately, I couldn't film inside, but I wanted to mention this place anyway because they sell gypsy-inspired products that are designed and made locally and it's worth checking out. 
I couldn't make a video about where to shop in Sayulita without including the Hippie Market. It's a collection of vendors located along the river, and there's a great selection of different handicrafts, including pom-poms, toys, and dolls. One of the things that makes Sayulita so colorful is all the pom-poms. I don't know if I've ever contemplated pom-poms in my life as much as being in Sayulita, and now I just want to buy them all, and they're all here for you to buy. <laughs> I featured the hippie market in my video about what to do in Sayulita, so I'll link that if you'd like to see more about it. We've spent quite a bit of time traveling in Mexico and made videos all over, so check out the rest of my channel if you'd like to see those too, and I'll link those videos and playlists in the description box below. I hope you enjoyed this video about the best shopping in Sayulita. Remember to give it a thumbs up if you did, and subscribe for lots more travel adventures around the world. Thanks for watching!